Hi there guys, Cormat here again with iSkySoft Video Editor for Macintosh and today we're going to be following up from our previous video and we'll be showing you how to split, trim, crop, rotate and adjust your home videos. So what I'm going to be doing is opening the previous video project that I started in the last lesson. Let's bump that into full screen and we'll hit the double green arrow at the bottom to change the zoom. We can also change the zoom by clicking and dragging on the uh, playhead area up here. So a single click just moves that and a click and drag moves it if you're touching the playhead, uh, otherwise it zooms, which is um, common practice for video editing applications. So what we're going to be doing, first of all, let me just go over the uh, split procedure. Um, you can just put the playhead into the middle of the video somewhere and hit the split button. I'll command Z that to just merge them back together. You can also click tools, split, or Apple B. Uh, Apple shift B will split all, um, which splits everything along the timeline that you have in terms of layers. So it'll split your music, your effects, that kind of thing. So very useful. If you wanted to say, okay, I'm just going to move all of these, that sort of thing. Anyways, undo that. So next up is trimming. I'm going to trim this end video uh, to here by just heading to the end, clicking and pulling that back. I'm going to do the same with the other two below. So again, click, drag, pull back. If you have a clip that ends, uh, Video Editor for Mac will snap to it at a certain level, like that. And again, just at the end here, snaps into place. So that way you always guarantee that you're precise. Okay, next up, let's show you how to crop the video. So I'm going to select this here, hit the crop button there, and let me move that. You can crop. 16 to 9, 4 to 3, or with a manual aspect. 16 to 9 fits my timeline, so I'm going to stick to that. But let's just crop it in. Ken burns it there. Done. So now I have the cropped video there. You can also do that just by uh, Shift Apple C or clicking Tools Crop. This does bring us to the next part of the video with Rotate. So this is already quite a kind of psychedelic video here. Uh, I could rotate that to be portrait or landscape. Um, this is very helpful. Uh, you can flip horizontal or vertical. I'm going to flip that horizontal there. Um, very helpful if you do have portrait video taken on a phone. You can use that to flip the aspect ratio and get it looking how it should. Okay. Finally, um, go back to that video inspector. We have our BC brightness contrast controls here. So I can bring that brightness down, bring the contrast down or up if I want to, turn my mate here into a glowing ball of C, brightness, let's bring that back up. And also you can change the hue, which is very useful, some nice color correction tools there. Let's leave that at zero, three, that'll do, zero. And we can desat desaturate or oversaturate using that saturation scale as well. Also click enhance to automatically denoise and enhance your video. Super useful for uh, things like GoPro footage shot underwater or just anything really that, that doesn't fit in where it should. There we go. That's that finished. Uh, I could hit export to re-export that video as I did before in the last. Um, but for now, I'm just going to hit Apple S to save my work. And we are done for the day. It's uh, Cormac here with iSkySoft Video Editor for Macintosh. And I've been showing you how to split, trim, crop, rotate, and adjust your videos. Thanks very much for watching. Speak to you next time.
Why are you